Prescott Van Meyer III selling in from home. And uh, the last time I took a shot of Malort infused with Carolina Reaper Roasty Buds coffee. Boy, that was a, quite a viral hit. So I'm back at it, but we've adjusted it just a little bit today. We're using the new Roasty Buds variety, Pumpkin Spiciest. I use ghost pepper coffee and of course pumpkin spice. In a previous video you saw, I tried the coffee and I enjoyed it quite a bit. Beautiful medium roast, wonderful pumpkin spice throughout. The ghost pepper was not overbearing, just had a nice little kick in it. And so we've decided to use that mixed with Malort. And if this piqued your interest, then uh, you might wanna jump on it because it's a limited time edition. It would really, uh, really help me out. So jump on Roasty Buds. Roasty Buds, order that quickly, quickly for me and for you. You're gonna like it. Hashtag PV3, Roasty Buds, incest. Okay, this stuff year round, you don't have to worry about that. Malort's always, always lurking on the shelves, ready to assault your intestines. And from what I gather, it just, it just stays there with you, just lingers like it's part of you now. There's pre-malort and post-malort. Can't ever undo it. Can't put that toothpaste back in the tube. Hmm, post-malort. I guess maybe that could be Post Malone's shitty, evil, shitty cousin from Chicago who has no talent whatsoever. When he tries to do a country music crossover, <laughs> Ugh. sounds like achy breaky heart. In fact, legend has it that Billy Ray Cyrus was drunk on malort when he wrote achy breaky heart. Did I just make that up? I don't know. I don't think you can bing that story. Now, before we get to this, I have a little story for you. Am I stalling? Probably. Screw you. But I heard through Roasty Buds, few of the sales that they had came through bing. And I just wanna say that warms my heart. And I do wanna clarify, they said there were two sales that were through bing. They were probably frantically wondering, uh oh, is Google down? They went to Google to Google, is Google down? Looks like Google's still up. What's going on? PV3 Nation to the rescue. So they all went out to Chipotle for lunch. All three of them on Team Bing. Separate checks. Corporate did not cover it. Although they might be an LLC. I'm not sure. They started as a corporation. Now they're an LLC. Pretty soon it'll be a sole proprietorship. If any members of PV3 Nation ends up buying Bing, let me know. Well, I've run out of things to say. So let's uh, do a little pour. Poof. Okay. That was uh, a lot. So those are the coffee beans coming out of the bottle into this. I need to strain them out. Those aren't little Malort turds, though one would be horrified to learn what a Malort turd would taste like. Ugh. You don't want to do this with a good fork. Certainly not silver. Uh, that tarnish will never come off. It'll be a curse on your house for generations to come. So just a quick reminder, this is pumpkin spiciest coffee beans and they were soaked in Malort. And that is what I'm about to take a really big shot of. That's a lot. Is there anything else I can mention? Anything else I can do? I told that last week. Oh, uh, uh, okay. And um, I'm hoping to get more free searches on Bing, so keep tagging them, because uh, I use up my three every day. Pumpkin spiciest, just to clarify again, pumpkin spiciest coffee beans and Malort all together. Ghost pepper and pumpkin spice. Medium roast coffee, roasty buds, bing it. So not bad, you know, decent. So the coffee is a little bit milder, but there's, there's heat. Ooh, this heat, it does kind of sneak in a little bit. Feeling that on the back of my throat and in my mouth. I feel like a jack-o'-lantern is teabagging me, but not a fresh one. One that's caving in from the rot. Dusty and moldy and gray. Squirrels have been in there had their way with it, left notes that said, thanks for the f shack. The juices are leaking down the steps. I just wanna make this clear. In the previous episode, you saw pumpkin spiciest 
was a really nice coffee and it was pleasant and had a little kick to it. But the abomination that's happened here is just a little different. I think maybe I just put in too many beans. I really think I should go to urgent care. Well, hopefully this one hits 2 million views. Then it'll be worth it. Oh God. And if you guys didn't see me riding a dragon, go ahead and look at previous episodes. I think my elbows are sweating. Whew. So thanks for joining us. See you next time. That's it. I, I got nothing left. Tanked. See you next time. I'm not gonna see you. My see you.